this is a quick video of me, a 19 handicap, playing some of the signature holes at Bandon Dunes Golf Course. Living in Oregon, I'm lucky enough to be within driving distance of Bandon Dunes and have been able to make five trips down there. So this is my third time playing this particular course. Forgive the tracer timing and the soundtrack. I do all of this on an iPhone 12 mini. My annual trip down to Bandon has always been on the week of or the week before Thanksgiving. And as you can see, on the Oregon coast in November, the weather is absolutely horrible. That's the ocean reveal that everyone talks about. And this is the reveal of me getting pretty lucky with the pitching wedge. And then walking out to see it because that looks cool. I could have zoomed in or taken the tripod down onto the green to show you the putt from up close. But honestly, this view is a lot better than the close-up view of some random high handicap YouTube hack trying to put in a five-foot putt. You're welcome. The next signature hole is the par four fifth hole. And this is where the ass golf begins. Majestic. After slamming the ball into the gorse, I couldn't find it. And then I forgot to record the next shot, which was a five iron over the other side of the fairway. Even though we started on the back nine because of a frost delay, I feel like this next sequence really was a welcome to Bandon Dunes moment for me, even though it came late in the round. If you want to practice for the sand at Bandon, buy yourself a dump truck full of either baby powder or powdered sugar. The sand is really, really fine. Every shot into any sort of sand, whether it's a waste area or a bunker, ends up in its own little crater. And you know things are going well for the YouTuber when there's a long putt coming from off camera. I don't even know if the par 3 15th hole is a signature hole abandoned, but it's too pretty not to record. So here's my 8 iron tee shot onto the infinity green. and I follow it up with a pretty tidy leg putt, which can be hard to come by sometimes on these very large, very quick greens. And then I close it out in style. Nice paw. It's a short walk over to the signature hole, actually on the whole resort, which is hole 16, 317 yard par four this day. So you don't expect a lot of great shots as a 19 handicap, but no better time, no better place to do this. That was my drive, putting from off the green over the brow of that little pot bunker, which kicked it pretty hard to the left. I get to step up and take a fairly pressure-free two-putt par from one of the best holes in all of golf. Thanks for watching, and if you ever have the chance to play Bandon, do it regardless of your handicap.